And thanks for joining us. I'm Terry McFadd. And I'm Lauren Moss. Happening tonight, people are gathering for a prayer vigil to remember the man who was shot and killed in a South Bend parking garage earlier this month. Our own Monica Murphy is live outside the Cathedral of St. James with more. Monica, what can you tell us? Yeah, on-site prayer ministry hosts these vigils. Anytime there is a homicide in St. Joe County, the vigil is just wrapping up. But, you know, they say that they host these because it's a way for them to honor those who have died. 62-year-old uh, Robert Pulliam Jr. was shot to death back on March 5th while working security in the Wayne Street parking garage. When officers arrived on scene, they found him suffering from an apparent gunshot wound to the head. Derek Pratcher of Elkhart has been arrested for the shooting. Police used photos from Polium's phone to connect Pratcher to the car that he was driving. Pratcher is facing charges including murder, unlawful carrying of a handgun, and more. We have them to uh, show the community that there are people, strangers. I mean, typically we don't know the deceased, um, but, you know, it, it helps bring closure. It helps, especially if the family is here, because they can see that people they don't even know are taking time out of their schedule um, to show up and support them. And coming up tonight at 11, we're going to have some more reaction from city leaders who are here at this vigil. They're going to just share um, ways to combat violence in our community. Guys. Monica Murphy live in downtown South Bend tonight. Monica, thank you.